Hey guys, welcome back to the homestead on this hot day. So I wanted to show you a project we are working on. We're starting today. Uh, let me get the camera turned around here, hold on. So if you can see this area over here, we have fenced in. Sorry if it's a little windy, might be choppy on the mic here, but this, this is the area. It's a pretty large area with a lot of our garden boxes. Well, we're actually gonna extend that area and actually double the size. So about another 60 by 60 foot area here. So we're gonna put up, because last year the deer just crushed everything. <laughs> that wasn't inside the fence. So these deer are just killing me every year. So we're going to get started on that. So let's get our poles and everything pounded in. And we're gonna put a couple gates as well. Getting some more garden boxes and we'll be roading tilling up some dirt as well. So let's get rolling. guys we are getting the start of our fence here and if I want to show you these cat's claw fasteners how good they work going into the post even with this wire clamps are right down to the post good and uh, makes it a lot easier than pounding steak Look at that. <laughs> Boy, does that make your life easy. So I'll put a link in the description below to these. These are awesome. <laughs> and they come with a quarter inch drive. It just takes a quarter inch drive to use them, but it comes with one as well. All right, guys, I picked these lock jaws up. They're cheap post fasteners, and I did them for my pasture, and I'm telling you what, if you wanna save time putting cheap posts on, that's what they look like. And watch how they go on. They're really easy to put on. You just put one end around there, That's it. <laughs> very, very easy. Yeah, so we're gonna put four down each side. So all you do is you get one end in like that, go around, this V goes on the one side of the T post, and then you just kind of push in on the wire at the same time. And uh, just a nice, <laughs> Yeah. Yep. Probably should take my gloves off, make my life easier here, but there. All right, there we go. Our garden expansion is continuing. We're almost done. Um, so we have this gate on the front here, but if you walk into the garden, you can see how much longer it is now. We went all the way around our blueberry bushes, some trees, our raspberry plants. Um, that was the old back gate, and now we put it on the side, but we added another doorway. And if you can see the two wood posts over there, right there. So Steve is in the garage now working on a gate for there. We just have to decide which color to make it. But so we will show you what that looks like when it's all finished. 
Well, I'm finishing up the gate here for the new section and that we added on and this is the frame for it. It's about four foot nine across and about the same distance, about four foot seven down. I just needed the, the width to be the most important thing. And uh, so before I put the wire on, we're gonna paint this and my wife wants either yellow or pink. So I'm gonna go see what we have for paint and we'll get it painted up and uh, get the wire on. So we went with pink. <laughs> I actually like it. So we'll let that dry for a little bit and then um, put some wire on it and get it hung tomorrow. All right, so we got the gate all done and we are going to hang it now here. So I got some old hinges here that I had from a long time ago. So these will, a little too big, but they'll do the trick. The gate is hung. Getting overcast here, so sorry if the wind's a little muffling <laughs> the old mic here, but uh, pretty happy with it. Mama wanted a pink gate, so we made it pink. So we have a blue, or more turquoise, entry gate there pink side gate and then a white wide gate so you can get tractor and stuff in through in here so we are completely fenced in now we're gonna add some more garden boxes start planting this weekend this gate turned out great but one of the things I love are these cat's claw fasteners make your life so easy and even on this thin fencing here they bolt right down pull it right down tight as you can see but man that turned out good garden expansion video part one <laughs> take care y'all god bless